What's going on, everyone? How you doing? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Josh K. The Lonely Hermit, and today, ladies and gentlemen, we are taking on the Texas Tyranitar in Week Four of Season Five of the Elite Battle League. This is going to be a, an interesting match. I mean, we have a, a pretty favorable matchup here. I'm not going to lie. Not quite the same as Week Four last season. That was that was bad. I don't think it's going to be the same. It just won't be. I don't think this will be a sweep. If it is, then you know, kudos to both of us. Knock on wood. It's not against me, but kudos. <laughs> I mean, I, I don't know. Um, I don't think it'll be sweet personally. I think we have the tools to be able to prevent that on both sides um, But regardless, this is gonna be a fun match nonetheless Please check out the doorman down in the description. Go watch his point of view. Um, go check out his match and uh, Be sure to subscribe to him and of course check out all the other coaches in the elite battle league as well um, So you can go see all the other matches going on uh, across the league so go check that good stuff out and the elite battle league channel i do videos over there so you guys if you want to see more of me which i know you do uh go, go check out the elite battle league channel um now i'm gonna be straightforward with you guys with this match um i'm gonna try obviously but i'm not sure like the result doesn't really matter a whole heck of a lot obviously a win will help us a whole heck of a lot in securing top two um but if we lose i know the results to some of the other matches i don't want to spoil them but i guess this is kind of spoiling it in a way um and we're in a good spot if we lose so it's not a big deal there's not as much pressure on this match as there was like a day ago before i knew all these results um but now that i know them there's less pressure on this match, so we're just gonna go into it, kind of get into a flow state, and just go. So, we're gonna get all linked up with the doorman and get right into this battle. Alright, we have linked up with Alan. I need to get my notebook ready. Ah! Why did I not prepare properly? Alright. Whew! The nerves are, are weirdly, like, we're, we're calming down a bit. We're not, you know, I'm not as bad as I've been <laughs> in my last couple matches. Um, last week was, I was just freaking out for some reason. I don't know why my, my heart was like pounding before the match and all that. So not Nate the Great, not the Pidge Missioner, not the Pepperoni Man, La Puerta, same thing as last season. Uh, we're going to be leading Zashin and we're going to let, we're gonna, just going to see what we can do. Zashin's a, a great lead for us. Um, the hope, the hope is that we can get a couple trades, uh, but more importantly, bait out his Dynamax and get rid of that as soon as possible. Uh, if we can do that, that'd be great. So he, Okay. Swamper. Interesting. Okay. More or less the team I was expecting. Swamper is like the only one that maybe I didn't see coming. I could see him leading Galvantula. I could see him leading Gar uh, Galvantula. Our man at 10. Evil Tall. Yeah, I think he'll recognize both my legends outspeed his whole team. Um, so he might just lead Galvantula, which is actually ideal for us. And I think if he leads Galvantula, we're gonna we're gonna attack right away. If he leads um, Snorlax, honestly, we'd be in a best, great spot. <laughs> or Swampert. Let's see how we do. Here we go. Here we go. Good luck, Alan. Good luck. Let's get into this. Let's get into this. I am nervous now. Now I'm nervous. <laughs> the nerves kicked in. I spoke too soon. So he's gonna lead Swampert. That's actually ideal here swamper does it carry a steel type move even then i think we take one sorry let me let me look over its moves real quick because if it doesn't carry anything too good iron tail that's the only thing i'm seeing here uh iron tail that's all i'm seeing a status move would be annoying but we do have facade we're gonna source dance Let's see what he does. He's if he switches, we get a free swords dance. If he's oh, you know what I should have done? I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm really dumb. I should have just gone to. Oh, I should have just clicked play rough. I should have just clicked play rough because he's probably gonna go to Grim Snarl. I should have just clicked play rough. I should have just clicked play rough. I really should have. I really, really, really should have. Okay, that's fine. Does he Dynamax right away? I don't think he was expecting this lead. I don't think he was expecting this lead. Okay, he's gonna stay in. Interesting. Please tell me we could take one hit. This would be bad if we lose Ashen right away. Earthquake. That's gonna do a nice chunk. But we should eat that. Oh yeah, wow. We can get off another story's dance, but I'm not risking that crit. Um, I don't know if I wanna reveal the facade early. Should we just close combat? Cause I don't want to miss. 
But I also don't want to start lowering my defense here. We'll click player up. Oh, I thought we missed. I thought we missed. Whew. Okay, so that's one. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Like I said, the hope is that we can bait his Dynamax and maybe get rid of one of his one of his other bigger hitters. Getting rid of Swampert is actually really nice. Not gonna lie. That opens things up for uh Naganadel a little more. Not quite enough yet, but it opens things up a little more for Naganadel. Snorlax. He's gonna Dynamax. We have CC for this. He's gonna max strike. That's what he's gonna do. He's gonna max strike. That's fine. That's honestly okay. That's okay. That's okay. I'm fine with letting Zashin go. This is what I wanted. This is what I wanted. I wanted to burn that Dynamax, and that's exactly what's happening. If we one shot, if we somehow one shot a, G, uh, a Dynamax Snorlax, great, but he's gonna max strike here. Um, but we burn his Dynamax, and we're definitely gonna take out Snorlax, so that's A okay with me. Oh, we nearly one shot. We nearly one shot. This is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt. It might kill. Might kill. Max Steel Spike. Max Steel Spike. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. You know what part of me wants to do? You know what part of me wants to do? Part of me. Part of me. Ooh, that wouldn't be a bad play either. I think we'll let Snuggy go. Well, I mean, I could use it for Blacephalon. I think it's fine if we let Snuggy go. Getting up, oh, getting up Stealth Rocks would actually be nice, though. Getting up Stealth Rocks would be nice. So it's carrying a Steel type move, and it's carrying. Okay. Oh, it is. It is raised in defense, though. That is a problem. That is a problem. We'll go to Snuggy. We'll go to Snuggy. Stall the Dynamax a little more. So I, it, honestly, Zashin did what it needed to do. Zashin did what it needed to do. Took out a Pokemon, essentially took out another one. He's gonna, he's gonna uh, max still spike again. He's gonna. If he, if he doesn't, I mean, fair enough. <laughs> yeah. There goes our disguise. I feel like a Drain Punch should still kill. I don't think it's worth Dynamaxing yet, honestly. I don't know if it's worth Dynamaxing yet. I feel like a drain punch should kill. I know it's plus two defense, but we're plus two attack. My heart is pounding. We do outspeed this thing. We'll try it. Why not? No, barely, dude. Barely. Barely. Oh, this, oh, this is probably going to kill. Actually, you know what? If it kills, that's actually not bad. Hold on. Hold up. Hold the phone. That's actually not bad. I'm going to be honest. It's actually not bad. Because I want to do this now. Because his Dynamax is over. So now I want to do this. Get the free kill. If he's smart, he'll switch. If he's smart, he'll switch. I mean, everything gets hit. Everything but Bustlefalon gets hit by this, by Sludge Bomb. Should I just Thunderbolt just in case? We'll do this. We do this. Screw it. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. He doesn't want to give us a free kill. He'll switch, but that's fine. We'll go plus one special attack. Eveltal. Okay. That's cool. We get plus one special attack. We get plus one special attack. It's probably carrying a ground type move. I wouldn't be surprised, but we outspeed this thing, so. We outspeed this thing. Which is the important part here. Uh, or Dragon Claw. He could be uh, carrying Dragon Claw again. That is a possibility. That's very likely, actually. So it is going to take a hit here. And he has no thunder check. Except maybe Galvantula, I guess. That does good damage. And we're plus one special attack now. That does good damage. We click this. No point. 
No point stalling it out. That should kill. And we'll go plus two. Boom, we all down. And we're plus two now. Does he bring out Bocephalon? Or Galvantula to try and paralyze us, maybe. Maybe he does that. Garmanitan? Just trying to think about every single possibility. <laughs> Galvantula, yeah. We're gonna max flare. Max flare and go plus three. That should kill. We're plus three now. That's a problem for him. That's a problem? I crossed off the wrong Pokemon. Darmanitan's not dead yet. <laughs> That's a problem because Lapras can come in and do a lot of work against the rest of his team. Lapras or even, um, what else do I have? <laughs> Lapras or Lapras? <laughs> One of the two. So he's gonna be able to hit us first. I wonder what he's gonna use though. We just click Dark Pulse. There's no point in switching. We outsped. Beautiful. That's a one shot. I think we. I think we. I think that's it. I think that's it. I think that's it. I think that's it. That was a crit. I don't think that crit mattered. I don't think that crit mattered. Mattered. <laughs> that's how nervous I am. <laughs> I don't think that crit mattered. I think that's it. I think that's it. We outspeed. We outspeed both of his remaining Pokemon. That's it. We max flare. The sun's still up. Or plus four. That's it. That's it. Oh my God! <laughs> oh, Zashin, you God, you did good work. That that was that was Zashin. This was all Zashin, dude. This was all Zashin. This was all Zashin. This was all Zashin. This was all freaking Zashin. And then we kill a Snorlax as well. So. This one's for you, Humberto. I got you. I got you. <laughs> Not a sweep, but hey, I got you, Humberto. I got you. <laughs> if nobody's got you, I got you. <laughs> Sludge bomb, and that's GG's. Woo! That was scary. That was scary, but we walk out with the dub. Naganadel goes huge. Naganadel goes he literally, <laughs> literally. Naganadel goes huge for us. Oh, that was, that was, that was my heart, man. I didn't even take a drink of anything because I was, I was just so focused there. Oh, man. 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 GG's Allen. Zashin did exactly what it needed to do. That's exactly what I wanted Zashin to do. I wanted Zashin to get at least one kill, but more importantly, I wanted to burn that Dynamax and it worked. He also did not invest his Blacephalon in speed, which helped us. Um, that definitely helped us a lot, um, but I still think we would have eaten one hit from the from the uh, Blacephalon. I think at least one hit. Um, but like I said, at that point, once he only had three Pokemon left, I mean, I had the rest of my team to be able to handle um, what he had left. So, GG's Allen, um, and yeah, <laughs> Naganadel. Hopefully, hopefully, close uh, to potentially getting an MVP here uh, this week. Um, but regardless, I mean, I don't really care. We walk over the win. We're four and zero. Oh. Uh, we improved to four and zero, which means we essentially lock in top two. Uh, we lock in top two and we retain first place. Um, so let's go. We got Mike the Quick next week to try and complete it. But you know, it is what it is. If we lose that, it doesn't really matter too much. It does, but it doesn't. Um, but regardless, I'm very happy with this win. Uh, and GG's again to the doorman. Go check him out in the description alongside all the other coaches in the Elite Battle League, so you not miss a single match in the EBL. Um, and also again, I do videos over on the elite battle league channel. So be sure to check that out as well Go subscribe to that. Um, so you do, you do not miss any videos from me uh, Lionheart plays Latin Luigi and Nate tube. We all do videos over there. So be sure to check that good stuff out And that's it again. GG's Allen check out all the links in the description go follow and subscribe It's necessary. It's all greatly appreciated and of course be sure to share social with your friends family everyone You know let the people know the lonely here. It's where it's at. We'll see you guys in the next one Bye